Okay. Hello. Now. Oh, there you are. <laughs> Hi. Hi. I have just done a feeling, a facial peel. You did the facial peel? Yeah. I want you to do something for my face. Oh, I cannot see you. Okay. Christy. Wash it off. Oh. Oh. Hello. <clears throat> okay, there we go. Can everybody hear me now? Yes. Yay. Oh my gosh. I was <laughs> like, what the heck? Well, my um, computer, it broke, uh, you know, about a week ago, and I'm still trying to add stuff back to it. So I, I had to download the Zoom thing again. It just didn't download. But anyway, so um, I'll just text a couple other people and see. Donna, I got your text. I was like, Oh my gosh, I hope she knows it's six, not five. <laughs> How's Brad? Well, I'm going to let y'all know in just a second yeah. here. Okay. <laughs> we get to see him. That's good. Yes. <laughs> Can I come up here? Come here. <laughs> Okay. All right. Well, I'm going to go ahead and um, just get started because we only have 30 minutes on here. So thank you to the ones who are on. I really appreciate it. I know there's some girls that couldn't be on. Um, Melissa just texted me and she's in the hospital right now in the ER room. So uh -huh. I guess she's having some breathing issues. So if oh. you keep her in your prayers, um, that would be really good. And Speaking of prayers, I just want to thank everybody and um, for all the prayers that you've sent me and Brad um, over the last few weeks. We really, we really felt them, and um, I wanted to bring him in tonight to t to talk to you about a little bit because he wanted to. So, go ahead. Dave. All right. Well, I just want to thank you all for all the prayers and, and so forth for us uh, going through this. Um, it's you know part way through. Things seem to be doing great. Decent to have some doctor's appointments next Today. week. Everything seems to be um, working out really well. Um, uh, I just want to thank you not only for the prayer, but also I want to thank you for all your hard work uh, that you guys have been doing uh, to keep the uh, unit going this month. And, uh, and if you haven't been working hard, let's get out there and and shake it up a little bit. You gotta, you still got about a week to to get get out there and uh, and move. So really appreciate you all, and uh, thank you for uh, what you do. Uh, thank you very much. Aww. Nice to see you. Thank you. <laughs> He's so sweet. Super well, sweet. We did, we did get some good news this week. The, um, the oh. pathology report came back, and um, he in the kidney, that at least in the kidney that they took the cancer out of, it was not the kind that metastasizes. So the doctor said he's cancer free on that kidney, um, but we don't know about the other one yet. So we're just we're just very grateful. And um, he wanted to get on and say that to you guys because we know that you guys have been praying for us and we just really do appreciate all of you. Um, yeah, anyways, um, I wanna um, so start out with some celebrations because I'm super excited. Um, Justine, can you maybe text Stephanie and remind her? I know she said she was getting on. She she is in Maine, but I'll text her and see if she's getting on. Yeah, because she um she she told me she was. She sent back mm -hmm. that thing, so maybe she just um forgot or you know. I'll text a couple other people. Donna, I'm so glad to see you. <laughs> Well, not see. I can't see you because your picture's off. Yeah. You have just to put the camera button. It was uh, red on me, and I push it, and then it turns white, and uh, we can see you. Yeah, because we can't. All we see is your name. We want to see your beautiful face. I don't know Dana's face. 
Donutsky. Yeah, do Marta doesn't know. Who there she is. Yay! Uh, I didn't have my camera on. Oh, good. Well, now you do, and we're happy to see you. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Okay. Um, well, I want to start out with um, some celebrations. Um, I'd really like Stephanie and, and Helica to be on here because I have a lot of celebrating with them to do since we didn't have a rally this month. But um, we do have um, two stars, Stephanie and Justine. So yay. Yay. Um, and I, Justine, why don't you tell us what you picked for your star prize? Oh my God, I still haven't picked yet because I can't decide. I kind of want the earbuds and the tower thing, but I'm not 100% sure if I want that or the $50 voucher. So I'm like, I, have to, I can't decide. Well, you know, about every other one I do that. I get a voucher, then I don't. But I did get that tower because it, I love it. I needed a, a Bluetooth speaker. And it's so pretty with the Swarovski crystal on it. That's what I thought. That's what I wanted it for. Yep, it's awesome. Oh, so. Christy, she said, um, oh, snap, we're uptown walking. I'm so sorry. They're on the beach. She totally forgot. Okay, well, I'm going to try, the last Zoom I did, I tried to record, and it didn't record for some reason. Okay. So I'm going to try and record it and tell her I'll send it to her. So, um, but anyway, so we want to celebrate Stephanie, too, because her first quarter, she was a star. And you Woo! Guys, yay, 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 yay. And that's super important. You guys, I, we all need to step up and be a star every single month, okay? It's not, it's not. Um, really that hard if you're working your business consistently and I'm get, we're going to start a consistency I, I got away from it for a couple of years because it was it's kind of hard for me to keep track of it but I'm working with a girl right now and we're putting something together for next year so the new quarter just started for this year and I'm super excited to say that Justine was an all-star not only was she a star Woo! but she was an all-star and so wow. At the end of the year at seminar, when you're an all-star, you get an extra prize. So last year, oh, I was going to bring it in. I forgot. I got that pink Kate Spade purse. My gosh, you guys, that's a $400 purse. Oh. I, $400 purse. <laughs> and so this year, it's the 50th anniversary of the pink Cadillac. And so it's going to be a Cadillac and I'm Justine, I'm not, there's different levels. So I know Justine gets to pick one of those and I'm super excited. Plus there's a party just for us. We get to go to a party and um, it's called the pink pearls party. And so she gets to be part of that. So a seminar, I'm, I can't wait. I'm just super excited to see y'all. I know Donna's going to seminar. Marta is, did you decide whether or not you could come? No, no, I'm not coming. Okay, well, we will certainly miss you. Thank you, guys. We will certainly miss you. But next year, you got to be there. Yeah. Anybody who doesn't sure. come this year has to go next year. And you know yeah, what, you no. guys, I know that a lot of you that are going to be watching this want to go to seminar. And sometimes it's just not possible. And I totally get that. But um, what I want you st to start doing is we know that seminar comes every year in July, every single year. So what I want you to do is I want you to get a pink piggy bank and I want you to put 10% of your money every month and put it in that or every sale and put it in that pink piggy bank. And by the end of the year, you'll be surprised at how much money's in there. And um, if you have the Mary Kay credit card, I um, and if you don't and you can get it, I would totally, even if you, um, you know, want to apply for it now, I would totally get that because you get two and a half points for every um, dollar that you order on that card. And so every, that, that's like saving money for me. Every year that has paid for my plane ticket. And usually I can pay for half of my hotel with that. And so with the money I save and that credit card, I pay for seminar. So, um, you know, just think about it. It's $199 to get for the seminar registration. Then you got to pay for your hotel and you got to pay to fly. And then you got a couple of dinners you're going to have to pay for. So um, just start thinking about it now. Now's the time and start saving for it so that we can have everybody with us next year. We want to have twice as many people next year. Okay. Christy, Stephanie called in. Oh, she did? Yeah. Oh, hey. I am on the beach. Oh, yay, Stephanie. I'm so happy. Well, we were just celebrating you, Stephanie, so I'm so happy that you can hear us. 
Thank you. We were celebrating you being a star for the first time. And Whoa! congratulations. Hey. Thank you. Again. And um, then I want to also congratulate you for being the queen of hostel. I'm sorry. I'm really behind on getting my gifts out, but you will be getting um, a prize from me. Um, oh, that's fine. Queen of hostel. Yay. Whoa! Prizes are always oh. good, right? Yeah. yeah. And then we have a queen of recruiting, and unfortunately, she's not on either. It's Angelica Elias. So I'm super proud of her. I think her. Let me see if she texts me back. I don't see anything from her. She must have forgotten. Um, super proud of her. Um, she got three new people and um, last month. And, um, you know, you guys, one other thing I want to go over with you is a lot of times we recruit people and then we never hear from them again, right? Anybody, I mean, Donna's had that happen. Justine has had that happen. I've had that happen. It just happens. And so I don't want you guys to get discouraged by that. I want you to know that that's part of the business. It's just like people don't always hold their parties. That's why we always say, if you want to hold one party a week, you got to book three because at least one or two are going to cancel. So you know, and it's like that in life. It really doesn't matter if we're talking about Mary Kay, if we're talking about, um, you know, a wedding or a baby shower. When you send out 20 invitations, only half of those people show up. And I know it's really frustrating when people have a wedding because people say they're coming and they pay for their plate, right? And then they don't show up and they still have to pay for that plate. So it's not just Mary Kay. It's everything in life that we're doing. So just remember that and just remember that is a business where you have to double your effort. And I'm gonna read something I was reading in the Mary Kay book uh, before we leave here. But um, again, I really want to um, give a shout out to Stephanie for being her first quarter star and also queen of hostel. That was awesome. So give it up for her. And then um, our amazing Justine for being not only a star, but an all star and getting to get that extra gift at the end of the year, because we're going to, it's really going to be fun. And um, also um, the keys. Okay. So Justine has been a key achiever every single month of this year. So Justine, I don't know if you know it or not, but you're going to get an extra gift, an extra key piece of jewelry. I don't know what it is um, at seminar as well. Yay. So. Um, you just want to make sure that you guys, the company's pro promos that they're doing, you know, try and hit those. Those are there for a reason. They're not just because they want to give you a piece of jewelry. It's because when you hit those targets, it's making you money. So that's the whole idea of this, right? We all love the prizes and we all love everything, but we, we need to make money, right? We're not doing this for our health. Um, at least I'm not. <laughs> Right? I, mean, I love my job, but would I do it for free? No, I want to make money. So, um, you know, try and hit those targets. And um, then I also want to give an extra shout out to Danielle and Justine for jumping in and being my cheerleader. I mean, Justine and, and Stephanie too got on a conference call together last week and um, started, um, you know, a little challenge for everybody. And Justine, from the bottom of my heart, and Stephanie, you too. That just, I can't even, it, it made my heart just so happy. <laughs> I just appreciate it. And every time I think of it, it makes me want to cry. And I had a long talk with Justine and, you know, just, um, just, just by sheer, you know, help like that, just, just lifted my spirits for that day. And I was kind of having a rough day, but when I was talking, you're going to make me cry again. When I was talking to her that day, she just made me really happy. So thank you guys. Thank you for rallying. And um, I want to talk now about the state of our unit. Okay. So the state of our unit right now is not real good. And I want y'all to know that in order for us to stay a unit, we have to do a certain amount of minimum production. And that minimum production, I just thought of somebody else who might have not been able to get on. Let me just double check with her.
Okay. Um, that certain amount of minimum, pro minimum production needs to be done every month. And you guys, we're not minimalists. We have been on a roll. This unit, we were number four in the state of Arizona all up until this month. Number four, that's pretty good, right? I've never been that high. And um, so, you know, and, th and that's a direct reflection of our unit and what you guys have been doing. Because we've been, we've had so much momentum going into this you know, end of this year. And then it was like June came and I don't know what happened. And so <laughs> I really need, we've got a week left and let me tell you where we are. We're, our production right now is 3,580. Our minimum to stay a unit is 4,500. Y'all, we have been normally doing eight to 10,000 regularly since, since last July. We've never gone under $8,000 except for this month in a whole year. So um, that just means that we just need to get the momentum back and um, we need to get our mojo back, right? Because we are, we're champions. We're winners. We are a great unit and we want to be on a winning team, right? Everybody wants to be on a winning team, right? Yeah. And we are winners and we're not losers. And so what I'm asking y'all to do, okay, so we won the Equinox last month. It was done, it was a done deal. And all we needed for this month was 6,500. Well, I figured, you know, we're, we always do eight to 10, that's just a done deal. Well, where we are right now means that we need for that Premier Plus $4,700 left to get that done. And so that's a lot of production. And so, but we're champions. And I know that we can get real close to that and finish it up. I have no doubt. So what I'd like you guys to do is think about um, a stretch goal for you and what you think you can do in this next week. Because we have from this Sunday to next Sunday to do this. And I want you to make a commitment to me and to our team, not just to me. And you, know, you guys, listen, I'm going to drive a free car regardless of what it is. I don't care what it is it doesn't matter to me it's not the car it's what it represents it represents our units hard work and we've worked really hard this year i want us to finish this up right we're this close and we can do it but it's going to take a little bit of work this week and i know it can be done i sat here this week and i went through my customers and i started making phone calls i was like okay i'm gonna start with all my repair customers because that's the best sales I get, you know, they were out of everything. I sold repair sets, not just little pieces of it, but three of them this week. I sold, a, um, I had a customer call me that needed a new um, clear proof set. I sold a time wise set. I've sold almost 700 and some dollars in the last week. And so if I can do it, I know you guys can too. And if you don't have customers, then get out there and get some leads. It's super important. You guys have got to have leads to work with every single day. And um, if you don't have any leads, call some of your friends. You know, who do you know that, um, you know, be, have, be a, have a silent hostess. Do a 24 by 24 by 24 and have them be the silent hostess. Give them a book. Tell them to give it to their friends. And if they sell 24 items to 24 people in 24 hours, you guys, that's over $500. That's like $576. And so if you had three or four people doing that, even if they did 100 and you had five people do 100, that's 500 bucks right there. And tell your hostess that they can have a 50% off shopping spree or that their order can be free. I mean, if even if they ordered $100 and you gave $50 away free. But if you had those people selling for you, they're going to put you in touch with other people that you don't know and then you're gonna be able to deliver some product and possibly get classes from them, right? Um, you know, call all your customers, you guys, and here's what I don't want you to be doing. I don't want you to be having a sale and, and putting it on Facebook every other week about, you know, I only have 93 more items to sell to win this cruise, can you help? Because you know what, we don't need to be begging our customers for this, and they get tired of it, right? Um, and they get tired of you asking all that all the time. I have two sales for my customers a year. I have a Pink Friday sale and every month um, I send out to all my customers that have birthdays, they get 20% off that month. So you don't need to be having a sale every single month.
but you do need to be keeping in touch with your customers. So if you're not, if you don't have a system where it comes up every month, put it in your date book. Every three months you need to be um, talking to your customers, right? And um, it's getting to be PCP time. So it's a good time to get all your customers loaded in your computer so that they are ready. You're ready to send that lookbook out when it goes out. It's um, right now it's through July um, 17th, I think. Um, yeah, now through July 17th. So get all your customers in there and get that done. And then if you add more customers, which hopefully you will in the next month, then you can continue to um, put them in the preferred customer program as you go. And you guys, I wanna say that we don't just need to be um, doing being a star consultant this month or finishing up strong this month. We gotta keep this momentum going into next month because July is a super slow month normally. I mean, it, it's historically throughout the company, a slow month, but we don't need it to be. If you, everything that you do this month is going to carry you over into next month. So we got to keep this going strong, right? We got to, you know, we had, um, you know, Liz for a long time. Um, and by the way, Liz's unit's doing better than ours is, and she's a baby unit. So <laughs> we got to really get up there. But, um, you know, we've got to, um, you know, somebody else has to step up to the plate and lead the way. And every one of you on here, I know, are leaders and can do that. I just need you to do it this month. We've got to finish this up, ladies. And um, so I want you to think about the championship game. You know, this is it. We're, I mean, we're in the World Cup. We're the Women's World Cup right now, right? We are going to kick that goal into the, or kick that ball into the goal right? Because we can, we can. Miracles happen in June every year. I've seen it. I've seen it. I've seen it. And that's why I kind of really wanted to have this call because we really do only have one, um, one week left. Also, I want you guys to take advantage of the company promotion with this skincare set. You guys, do you realize, let me see, I brought it out here. The profit on that you know, if you did just 13, your profit on that would be $858 if you sold all 13 of them. That's a lot of money, you guys. So, you know, max that out. Um, if you maxed out all the sets, which, you know, that's a lot of money. That's uh, 3,796 wholesale. But some of your team members are going to be coming in with some inventory and you've got to encourage them to take advantage of it this month because right now is when they need to be doing that inventory so that they get that 60% instead of 50%. Um, if you did 3796 wholesale, your profit when you sold it would be $5,695. That's almost, almost triple, right? So it's like getting $999, $949 free. So just remember that. Then um, I put out an extra promotion. So we've got the uh, promotion for a thousand dollar wholesale. You earn a girl's day of beauty or a $75 gift card if you live out of town. If 300 is a $5 Amazon gift card, 450 is a $15 Amazon gift card, 600 you get your key jewelry but i also added if you order 600 this month i'm going to give you a hundred dollars in the free foundations the new foundations that we have so you're going to get you can get all of your foundations and more i think you can probably get double with that for a hundred bucks or if you want something else then whatever you want i'll order for you so you get your key jewelry plus you get a hundred dollars in free product from me so um you know that's one promotion the other promotion is when we hit uh, 10 new agreements this month, I'm going to give away $100 cash. We have three agreements in. We need seven more. Um, and then um, for every team member you add, your name goes into that uh, one time. So right now, um, but we have to hit 10, so we still need three more or seven more, but three people have their names in. Danielle has it in one time, Justine has it in one time, and Dora has it in one time. So um, who do you know that we can share this opportunity with this week? Um, and then I wanted to talk about this. I, I told y'all to print it out. Did y'all, were you able to print this out? I know Donna said her printer wasn't working and she couldn't do that. Okay, so this is um, a training um, center 
with different calls on it. I, I really want you guys to go through and listen to each one of these and just get a refresher course. Cause these are, uh, you know, top directors in Cindy Williams area. And since we don't have a national anymore, it's really good to be able to listen to other people besides me. You know, you never know what you're gonna get from someone else. And when the student is ready, the teacher will come. And sometimes I can say something a million times over and y'all are so used to hearing my voice that you just, it just goes in one ear and out the other. And so it doesn't bother me in the least. If you get it from someone else, just get it. <laughs> and so some, sometimes you can do that with all of these, okay? So I really want you to listen to these. And when you've done it and you've finished each one of them, I want you to call me and let me know and um, I will have a gift for you, okay? So that's that. And then I wanna really talk about the Million Dollar Conference Call. You guys, this is a daily recorded call, daily. That means every day you need to get on and listen to it. And we've got some people who are real consistent on it and some people who aren't. And so if you're one of the people who aren't consistent, you know, put a note on your bathroom mirror while you're getting ready in the morning, listen to it. While you're um, driving to work, listen to it. While you're riding, you know, your horse, listen to it. Um, just listen to this. <laughs> Thinking of you, Donna. <laughs> But, um, you know, it's, these are such good nuggets of information. And then you guys, when you listen to it, it helps you to remember, this is one of the reasons why I want you to get on Boxer. Number one, it helps you to remember what you just listened to. Have you ever gone to church and then come home and somebody said, oh, well, what'd you learn in church? And you're like, I don't remember. Well, same thing with these calls, right? It can go in, listen to it. Oh, that was a great call. But if you repeat it back and you say what you got from it, number one, it helps you to remember what you just listened to. And number two, there might be somebody who listened but didn't hear what you did. So everybody has a different perspective on it. And so it really helps. So I'm asking you to please, please, please get on this every day. It also helps us to build esprit de corps and, and with each other, you know? And when you've done something really good, get on there and let us know about it. And so we can all cheer you on because we need to be cheering each other on, especially now when we're going for this big finish, okay? We need to be cheering each other on. And um, I know that we're gonna, I know we're gonna get a whole lot of stuff done this week. It always happens, I, I start freaking out, but I know it's all gonna come together. I know God's gonna be there with us and um, I know he's going to do that. Okay. Um, the, was there anything else? I, I wrote notes down. I think that was it. Um, I did want to read this little thing from Mary Kay's on people management because I've been reading this book and it's so good. Um, and I think it applies to us right now. In Lewis Carroll's Alice Adventures in Wonderland, the Red Queen advises Alice. Now, here you see, it takes all the running you can do to keep up the same place. If you want to get somewhere else, you must run twice as fast. Although Carol wasn't thinking of today's business world, his advice is nonetheless applicable. It takes all the running you can do to become your best, but you must run twice as fast to progress. At Mary Kay Cosmetics, we express this thought as you can't rest on your laurels, for nothing wilts faster than laurels rested upon. In a career, you either go forward or backward. You don't stand still. Everyone must continually improve his or her skills in a lifetime self-improvement program. As you are planning such a program, I think it's good to remember the following guidelines. Keep up with change. Become thorough, thoroughly knowledgeable in every aspect of your business. Don't forget the basic skills that got you started. Keep yourself in perspective by never getting too big for your job and share your ideas with others. It helps both you and the idea grow. So I, I'm gonna end with that. Um, does anybody have anything to say? I was wondering how much you have to order to be a star. Um, it's it's $600 a month. So that's, uh, that's selling. Okay, so we don't want you just, guys, and here's another thing. I don't want you guys just to order, just to order. I want you to be selling the product. So when you sell, Marta, $300 a week, you are a star. Because if you sell $300, you've made $150 profit, you put $150 back into your business, right? And so $150 times four is $600. And so you're making $600, and you're putting $600 back into your business. 
So that is um, just, it's as simple as that. So just remember that you want to sell, retail, sell $300. Spend $600. Mm -hmm. $300. Right. And at the end of the month, you want to order 600 and have 600 in your pocket. Does that make sense? Does everybody understand? Yeah. That? yeah. Because otherwise, yeah. If I yeah. put everything, yeah. Yeah. So we don't want you putting everything back in unless you don't have the inventory on your shelf. But you guys, there are some times when you do have to invest in your business. Like when we have new products come out. Yeah. Like you got to invest or when they have a sale, like it's going on with the miracle sets. Now's the time to invest. Um, if you're going to invest, this is a good time. So you have to work this like a business. And if you think about it like a businesswoman, it's going to pay you like a business. And I, I again, want to just really brag on Justine because I have seen a huge shift. I mean, when I was out there, she did, she had her, her office in this little bitty in her bedroom. You could barely even get in there. Now she has this big office and she has inventory on her shelf. And I know that's made a huge difference in why she's been so successful. Do you think so, Justine? Oh, absolutely. <clears throat> Once I invested in that and got inventory, I was like, it was, I sold so much easier and faster. Because we don't want to sell something if we don't have it. We're afraid, right? And yeah. if you don't have it, the best thing you can do, you guys, is to get out there and sell and then invest your profit back into your business until you do have it on your shelf. Because mm -hmm. people want this. This is a business where women buy on impulse. And so that's why they have cosmetics on the impulse aisles in the grocery store, on the end caps, as you're going out of the grocery store, right there at the end where you can pick up stuff, right? Because it's an impulse buy. And women, that's what we do. And when they're out of their stuff, they're out of it. And if you don't have it, you're, they're going to, um, you, you're going to be sorry that you didn't have it because of it was Okay, so anybody else have anything they want to say? Um, I, I want to set, uh, I want to put out an intention. So at the moment I have, um, seven leads and, um, my intention is that at least five of them make a party. Yay. Good. Good for you, Marta. Yay. <laughs> Anybody else? <laughs> Donna, I know you haven't been on, but this is Marta. She lives in, um, I know you know the area. So she lives in um, Arizona right outside of Casa Grande in Arizona City. And okay. as you can Hi, tell, she's, she's from Italy. And um, I met her because her and her, her awesome, amazing husband came down to Tucson and came to a, a women's night out booth. Um, that actually Liz was doing and I couldn't do it. So I gave it to her and said, just split the leads with me. And Marta was one of the leads. So I got super lucky when I met her. So we're excited to have her as part of our Thank team. You. We love you. And Donna, I'm so happy to see you. And I can't wait. Y'all, I cannot wait till seminar. We're going to have a great time. It's gonna yes, be we are. Yeah, so absolutely. Did y'all get your dresses yet? No. Mm. Okay, well, I'm going to make sure that I show my dress this year. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody buys the same one as I do, okay? <laughs> oh, that was funny. <laughs> yes, Christy, please show us your dress, and we'll all go out and buy one. Right, whatever, <laughs> y'all are so mean. <laughs> Marta, we had, uh, me and Raina had the same dress on, except for, I had <laughs> up and I had it down this side right here and I thought gosh our dresses are similar well I just didn't know that I didn't have the sleeve on that I was supposed to have it. <laughs> supposed to be a sleeve it wasn't supposed to be sleeveless so yeah oh, that was I will that'll be a seminar story for the rest of the <laughs> yeah. they all laughed at me they thought it was funny so I just oh. had to sit there and take it <laughs> so anyway Okay, y'all. I love you guys so much. Thank you for all your hard work. I really appreciate it. And um, let's just finish this month out strong. I know we can. I know we've got lots of, lots of good stuff coming up. And then let's, you know, catapult into July. Let's not make July a slow month. Let's not stress your director out all month of July. Okay. <laughs>
Okay. All right. I love you guys. I'll talk to you later. Love you too. Bye. 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 Bye.